So, Titalium, what's your story anyway? We don't really know much about you. What's up with you? Well, you see, the sheep killer. I have a pretty deep backstory, as you know. I don't know. Why do you think I'm asking you? Uh, yes, of course, but, uh... Yeah, I have a pretty deep backstory. And it all starts when I was a little... Baby squid. As you know, Santa never gave me presents. Yeah, that's... That's pretty obvious. That's... The reason why you attacked us during Christmas. Or at least attacked Santa. You didn't really do much besides that. But yes. I've had this house for a long time, of course. That's actually why Santa never gave me presents, as I didn't realize until later. We all know you hate squids. I am the king of the squids. Are you really? Yes, of course. Our kingdom isn't quite as well known as the sheeps or the creepers, but I am the most powerful of all squid kind. Ah. Okay. So that's why you take action, but no other squid. Because you're the most intelligent and powerful. Yes, that's right. And this is my home. I've noticed you've been doing a lot of squid killing lately, the sheep killer. So are you going to try to say that you don't tolerate that? No, not at all. Us squids respawn quite quickly. Much more so than the sheeps. Okay, so you don't care? Nah, and even if I did care, there was nothing I could be able to do to stop you. Yeah, that's true. And I've noticed that your voice is getting a little less consistent there. I can't help it. I won't be much more prominent on this channel anyway. I'm not as much of a recurring character as, say, the Sheep King or Sheep Koo Black. Yeah, that's true. So you're... that really wasn't much of a backstory. Basically, you're the king of squids. You don't care that I'm killing them since you respawn a lot. And... You've always had a horrible Christmas, and this is your house. How long have you lived here? 100 years. I am quite old, you see. Okay. So that's it for your story, then? Yes, it is. Now you may go. Okay. Again, that wasn't much of a story, but... How many characters do have much of a backstory on the Sheep Killer universe? I think the Sheep King is like the only one with an in-depth backstory. Well, and Sheep Koo Black. But yeah. So that's it. I can go now. Yes. Even though I don't care that you kill my kind, I still don't like you, so go. Well, good, I don't like you either. So, goodbye, Tentalium. He has a weird name, by the way. Who came up with that? 